I wanted to make a quick video about the bit holders on our multi-chuck, our 12 volt installation drills. This is the DeWalt 5-in-1. This is the beloved and despised <laughs> M12 installation drill. So uh, the bit holder, it accepts these two inch bits that have this deep recess. I mean, sometimes you find that on longer bits. Some there occasionally you see short bits that have that, but most of them are, are these two inch bits. And people like this kind of bit holder because the bit will go in and lock in with one hand. You need two to get it out. But the problem is that this is about, you know, getting into tight places. And, you know, these two inch bits make the whole shebang longer. Now, if you, you can put one of these in here, but it's going to get stuck. And it, maybe you could use that. It almost looks like a drywall setter, but you won't be able to get it out without a pliers. There you go. But, okay, so what? You can put the short bit into the magnetic holder on the, uh, on the chuck mount, and you've got yourself a really short driver, which is great. The problem is that if you've got a good bit that really bites into your fastener, it can get pulled out and be falling either someplace where you're going to lose it or someplace where it's going to scratch your finish work. So that's the downfall there. Um, the DeWalt has a similar chuck. It's the same deal. Also, you just insert it, which is great. One hand, you don't need to monkey with that in order to get the bit in. And the same deal, if you want to get a really compact driver, you can put the one inch bit right into the chuck mount there. And it will come out not so hard, maybe a little bit easier than the uh, Milwaukee. Um, but with the, the bit holder mounted, it suffers from being long. In this case, the DeWalt's doing a little bit better than the Milwaukee, but it's still quite long with the, with the long bit. So um, DeWalt has the same kind of bit holder on their offset. Same action, push it in, it locks. You need two hands to get it out. Their right angle has the magnetic holder. Again, you can put the one inch bit into that if you're getting into someplace tight. Milwaukee, they did not give us a locking bit holder. They just gave us a magnetic bit holder on the offset, which is probably the last place you'd want to have it because you're probably most likely to be putting something in in a tight spot and you don't want your bit to stick to the screw and pull out of there at that time. Um, they have the same deal on the right angle. Yep, you can uh, drop <laughs> your one inch bit in there. But again, their magnet's a little bit stronger than DeWalt's. It's hard to get it out. So let's just look at the Bosch. Okay. Its bit holder gladly holds one inch bits. You can put two inch bits in it as well. Now it's not push and lock. You have to, you have to pull this sleeve down in order to get the bit in and to get the bit out. But it happily grabs onto a one inch bit. This is the one I had in there. And it makes the drill much shorter. I mean, a lot shorter for getting into tight spots. Now, um, if we look at the Bosch chucks, we find they have the same exact bit holder on the offset chuck. 
Of course, it also accepts the longer bits. And there, they don't actually mount the chuck on that, but it is a magnetic holder. And so you can always put the bit in there the same way as the others. So that's, it may not be the easiest way to get your bit in and out, but it certainly is a, a great advantage when you're trying to use the drill in a compact space, in a small space. So the only other one I have is the Metabo. And uh, it's interesting that it has what appears to be a Weir Rapid adapter on its bit holder. So I have a Weir Rapid adapter that I use on my, my Makita. I'll leave that in there for driving screws. And uh, it also, if you've never had one of these, it does latch on just by pushing in and by pushing out pops out, but it also grabs happily onto one inch bits. So you can use the smaller bits on that. And lo and behold, the Weir has the same, the uh, Metabo has the same Weir bit holder, which is nice. Um, there's nothing magic about you know, pushing to lock that it has to be a two inch bit because clearly the, uh, the rear rapid adapter chuck uh, bit holder is doing that. And um, if we look at Metabo's chucks, they don't have one of these rear rapid adapters on the offset, but lo and behold, what is that on the Metabo offset? Wouldn't you know, it is the same bit holder that we have on the Bosch. So, yep, it will take the two inch bits, but it will also take the one inch bits, which is a huge advantage. And of course, like all the others, it has the magnetic holder on the right angle chuck. So, all right, just uh, wanted to look at those and talk a little bit about bit holders with our multi-chuck installation drills. Thanks.